In this example of DFM Pro, we have a particular part that has some unique features. Um, in this case, we want to go ahead and just start with a, um, what we call the uh, build direction. Once that is defined, let's go ahead and run this. We see that result is displayed in our HD 3D tools. And then uh, each one of those as we select, let's go ahead and look at in the advanced view comes from uh, DFM Pro. The first thing you want to look at is faces require support. We notice that some of these under lying faces at both in counterbore and also some of these clip uh, edges that uh, perhaps that they need some additional support. Um, so let's take a look at that and let's see what we can do to uh, uh, capture that as an image. And then uh, as we indicate, this might uh, require support. We might want to think about, you know, if this is necessary, we want to change that as a design. We can also consult what is the standard. The standard defines that uh, certain angles, certain uh, pull directions uh, or build directions. So then, uh, then you need to have some kind of a, a support. The next one I want to go ahead and take a look at is what we call the uh, filler radius. This is uh, always recommend a minimum to be a certain size just because as you are uh, being utilized the uh, the built um, you know, certain diameters in the uh, material might not be able to support that. And then the next thing we want to look at that is a particular gap. Sometimes these gap might just a little too small needs to be greater than a certain value. So in this case that uh, it defines what that value is on the information window. The next thing what we want to do is take a look at the thickness between. And once again, based on the uh, build direction, um, it defines what is the recommend should not be anything, um, you know, has to be greater than uh, 2.2 uh, millimeter. So in this case, once all that's done, as we capture some of these images, the images are once again inside of our report. And these report can be uh, utilized to uh, review the part later on to understand what some of the things has been analyzed, what some of the things I recommend to be uh, changed. These are all part of building inside of our DFM Pro tool. Thank you.